Today I'm going to show you how to use HTML coding to insert an image into either your eBay listing or of course your website and pretty much anywhere where HTML coding is accepted. Now the first thing we're going to require is a photo host. If you don't already have one of those then I recommend PhotoBucket. It's very simple in its design and very easy to use. Plus it's free to join and you only require a few details to do so. So pop photo book it into your browser, hit the link and we'll be ready to go. So once you've loaded photo book it, what you're going to see on the home screen are some tabs across the top. We want the pale grey one, the upload button. Go ahead and click upload. This will then give you this screen. Click on the pale blue box to select the image of your choice. Select it and press open. Photobook it will then upload it, the image for you. Once it's uploaded, you'll be given four options. The HTML code is the one that we're interested in. So if you click in the box there, it will copy that for you. Now you need to head on over to eBay. If you're not familiar with eBay, I will be doing a video on how to sell on eBay at some point. But for today, I'm going to assume that you already have a seller's account and that you are familiar with eBay. So what you need to do is create yourself a listing. Now, when you get to the details tab, you're given two options, standard and HTML. Go ahead and click on the HTML. So once you're on the HTML screen, all we're simply going to do is paste the text that PhotoBucket provided us with. You can click the standard button. This gives you a preview of the image. To centralize it, you can use the standard eBay alignments at the top there. Just click on your image and choose left, right or centralized. To resize the image, simply click on it and drag the corners. You can make it whatever size you want. And then if you wish to add text below, simply locate where the box is, press enter and start to type your text underneath. To view your handiwork, simply click on the preview button with the magnifying glass and handily eBay will pop up a window showing you what your listing will look like. Ta-da! So here we have the finished result. This is just a screenshot of one of my eBay listings. As you can see, there's quite a lot on there. All of this is actually done in HTML, including the clicky links. That's what I call them anyway. At some point, I will be doing a video that shows you how to use Photoshop and Dreamweaver to create eBay listings and also web pages. But to begin with, I'm wanting to keep the videos very basic and progress to that point. Um, it's certainly going to require an awful lot of cups of coffee and maybe a few choice words when we get to the point that we're going to be using slices on Photoshop. So I'm hoping this video has been helpful for you guys. If it has, as usual, please don't forget to subscribe and thank you so much for watching.